I trained as a mediator in the late 90s. At that time, there was uh, an encouragement by the legislation to look at mediation as a solution. Actually, mediation as a concept comes from the US, America, and um, I was lucky enough to train with uh, a legal uh, a mediation training team in Bristol who were the forerunners, really, of mediation in England. Um, it blossomed through uh, that source because historically in Bristol they had already, already, always tried to create uh, a system of conciliation to divert away from full head-on dispute between individuals, particularly in relation to children, but it carries across to financial disputes between couples as well. Um, it was very attractive to me to, to look at that because uh, it is strangely painful for a family lawyer to see couples spend an awful lot of money on disputing their affairs. It also is painful to see the pain, emotional pain and stress that uh, that whole exercise creates. Uh, I say it might be strange because there's a traditional view of lawyers looking for fees and high fees and so on. But high fees are only justified in the right cases. If the case is seriously complex, international elements, lots of different types of money issues, perhaps failure to people to be fair and honest with each other, which means there's lots of inquiries that can eat up legal cost. But many, many cases can be resolved much more cheaply. My practice is in Eastbourne. I run a team of six family practitioners and two of us are mediators as well as family lawyers and I also practice as a collaborative lawyer myself. At Stephen Rivers in Eastbourne, uh, my family team uh, operates to provide a full, complete family legal service, but also uh, I operate out of uh, JAS Mediation uh, from the same building, offering mediation services with my colleague Wendy Still. I also have a uh, subcontractor mediator who has a particular qualification to meet with and assist children in mediation. It's quite a rare qualification and it, fortunately it's quite a rare event to involve children in a mediation process. But that is a very specialist role to talk to children in that context and we have that facility. Uh, apart from that, in my legal team, uh, we are a split with um, two of us uh, dealing with serious child cases. I'm one of those and Wendy still is another. Uh, we have Andrew Thurston and uh, Claire Pearman who uh, concentrate on financial cases. And we have uh, Francesca Martin and uh, Sarah Brooks who concentrate on uh, really the, the cases that the everyday couples face day in, day out. And that stretches across the right, all the parameters from child law to divorce law to financial issues. Uh, we're backed up with uh, a team of uh, assistants and uh, cost specialists and secretarial uh, supplies. Uh, Jane is uh, my particular personal assistant and is very much uh, the person who will have a very simple discussion with anybody who is making that initial call to find out more about mediation or collaborative law. And uh, she is uh, ready and willing to answer any query by just calling our main family mediation number, which is 01323 434 415.